So we have been talking a lot about a coronavirus vaccine, but doctors are urging all of us do not forget about your flu vaccine. During the 2018 2019 flu season, more than 34,000 Americans died because of the flu. But this year, how will you know if you have either the flu or COVID-19? Should we uh, be getting the flu shot earlier this year than normal? How do you know if you have COVID or just regular flu? One big question, will both viruses be around in the fall and winter? The CDC says it's likely. You might also wonder, how will I know if it's COVID or the flu? It's hard to tell the two of them apart. Right? Both of them will cause a runny nose, a fever, a headache. They'll make you cough. COVID and the flu have similar symptoms, but the COVID-19 virus often causes a loss of taste or smell. With the flu, a person develops symptoms one to four days after contracting the virus. For COVID, the time frame ranges and can be as late as 14 days after the infection. Another concern, having the coronavirus and the flu at the same time. Experts say it's possible, and some are wondering if the flu vaccine will protect them against COVID-19. The answer is no. It only protects against the flu, helping to answer your questions about two serious viruses. And you might also be questioning what is more dangerous, the flu or COVID-19, because we've heard mixed messagings over the last six, seven months. Well, right now, the CDC does say it seems that COVID-19 is more deadly than the seasonal flu, but that could change as researchers continue to analyze the data. And we know coronavirus has morphed and changed and certainly affects everyone differently. So there are still a lot of myths and misunderstandings about the flu vaccine. So if you have questions or maybe you just want to alleviate some concerns, tune into newsforjax.com this afternoon at 1230. I'll be hosting as five Jacksonville area doctors answer your questions during our flu vax Jax virtual town hall and there are their smiling faces. So get your free ticket to join this live conversation. I would love to get your individual questions answered. We can only do that if you sign up to be an insider. So not sure if you watched the last virtual town hall. It was on coronavirus last month and it was a great conversation. The doctors were real, approachable, relatable, and it is, it's just that kind of setting. So please join us, newsforjax.com. Sign up now for your free account to reserve your seat, submit your questions. We'll be right back after the break.